Will Wrinkly Kong ever wake up and save my game like a normal person? I don't know. It's unlikely at this point. I am Game Guy! It's time for more Let's Play Donkey Kong Country 2! Plus one. Uh, good day, crazy kitty! My name is Benny! Uh, my lift will never break down! You can be sure of it! Why is it snowy outside when we're not in Snow World anymore? Okay, sure! Uh, strap yourself in and away you go! Alright, Mr. Bear Dude. I made it to Kongfused Cliffs. Not to be Kongfused with anything else. By the way, the rope is on fire. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if you noticed. This level is neat. I like the idea behind this. It's not so much that this level is, like, super cool, I guess, because, um, I don't know. It is, this level's like a mixture of, um, it doesn't do a whole lot, and it does. I just, I like the idea. It's a silly idea. Uh, also, sometimes there's stuff off to the side, and, uh, heck if I can remember where that stuff is. Uh, because I know there's a fair amount of things. The fire does, in fact, hurt you, by the way, so, uh, you've gotta be careful. I think any time there's, like, a bonus or something off to the side, there's an INDICATION somewhere along the lines of such. I think probably I could have, uh, hovered over from a higher place. I didn't, however, but we could pretend that I tried if we pretend really hard. I don't feel like pretending, though, uh, so instead I decided to... Uh, Climb the the, the 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 slanted cliff there. Um, that, that was my decision to make. What is over here but barrels? I'm glad that the um the, the you just kind of latch on to the rope immediately. Because if you didn't, there would be all sorts of problems. Uh, you know, I probably wouldn't live and all that. Uh, it's an unfortunate side effect of falling to your death, is that generally you don't live. <laughs> I know, I, it's it's an amazing revelation that I have uh, discovered here. There's something over here, which is why I got hit by a, a bee. That was fun, I'm glad I wasted Dixie for that. There was nothing over there, but it turned out that there was in fact something over there. I don't know where the O is. Or was, rather. I missed it somewhere. But it's fine. I don't need to spell. This isn't a spelling bee. This is just regular bee. Um, okay, I was gonna say, I hope there's like a barrel or something, because I don't have Dixie right now. I can find the coin, though. Finding the coin is a thing that I can do. It's probably at the top of this rope. I don't know what gives me that impression, but uh, it's a pretty safe bet, I think. <laughs> All right, onward to the next part of the level, the part where I climb up a rope some more. I've never done that before, now have we? Pretty sure, no, we have not done that exact thing. I think my only real complaint with this level is that there's not, um, you, you can't see too much of the screen at once a lot of times. Um, I believe I want to hang out on the rope a little bit longer and jump up here, because, um, oh, am I remembering right? Yes, <laughs> coin was hiding in there. Oh, I didn't realize there was a, a, a cannon. Well, all right, you don't have to stay up there if you don't want to, but, um, you're certainly not going to get coin if you don't go up the rope. That is the joke of the level, because the rope disappears, obviously. It just, the fuse runs out, this is how it works. Uh, this is floodlit fish. It's a, it's a, it's, it's a water level where it's really easy to see. Um, oh, you know what? No, hold on. That's because this is secretly an Engard level. See, I am now a swordfish, and this allows me to hit that guy and light up the area a little bit more. Uh, but not this guy. This guy just gives me stuff. 
Not to be confused with the guy that expels light. Uh, those guys expel other things. Uh, sometimes things you don't want. Most of the time, things that you do. Uh, I'll let you uh, figure out what the difference is. Uh, thankfully, you can still kind of see when it's dark. So, you know, that's, that's always cool. Uh, this level was a little bit more tricky on TVs of old, where it was not as easy to see in the dark. Um, but, uh, with, uh, these mm, HD graphics that we got going on here, it's not so bad. I can kind of see a little bit. I'm still gonna brighten things up, though. I guess, after all, I don't actually know what this is gonna look like once it's on YouTube, because, uh... Sometimes the quality leaves a lot to be desired, but it's hard to say for sure. Um, oh, there's a bonus barrel. I was about to ask, like, man, we haven't seen a bonus barrel yet. Where could one be? And here it was. In the darkness, we gotta collect a bunch of stars. I don't know how we're gonna do it, but we're gonna have to do it. I don't know. That's the mystery of life. The mystery of life is where are all the stars at? It's too dark to see. Well, now that I am a fish in nothing but darkness, let us leave the bonus dimension back to our regularly scheduled dimension. That's always what I have wanted in my life. This is just the urchin maze. It's a very important maze. There were bananas there. I don't know if you noticed or not. Uh, I noticed, obviously, because I, I got them. Well, I mean, I didn't know it was actually there. I just kind of stumbled upon them, but, I mean, it's fine. You can kill these guys. I just don't like doing it because it's always kind of a risk. Just a little bit. Because, uh, you know, if they're closed, then you actually just hurt yourself, and uh, that's, that's no fun. I want to say... This level, okay, this level does have um, another bonus somewhere, obviously, but I don't remember where it is. Because uh, I remember, like, this, the latter half of this level gets a little bit maze-like, and it's kind of obnoxious when you're, you know, looking for stuff. This is a, a level where I'm probably going to miss um, various secrets, but... Um, it's fine. I don't know why there were bananas on both sides there. I don't know if this game does the whole you can go through certain walls gimmick that Donkey Kong Country 1 does. Because I know it does that a lot. It was never anything, like, super major that was hidden, usually. Because I don't think any of the water levels actually had bonus areas in the first game. Ow. <laughs> That was me taking damage. It's a wonderful time. Why do I remember there being something here? Like, in the middle. It's kind of... Please bring your light back, sir. I, I wish for you to be able to allow me to see. I was going to say, these urchins are going to come back up at some point. I probably shouldn't go this way. Which is why I went that way anyway. As you can tell, I am a smart fellow. Hmm. I don't know, maybe I'm just misremembering things. It's hard to say. I just, I kind of have vague memories of this level and, like, missing the second bonus a lot. Or maybe it was the first one and I just kind of happened to find it. Oh, you know what? I know where it is. I think it's down here. Um, which means I have to kill these guys if I want to get through... Yeah, there you are. I remembered it being somewhere in the middle of, like, a square-shaped area. That's all I remembered. <laughs> so, I don't know, I was just kind of looking around that one spot for no real reason in particular. This is just the, uh, the bonus where you have to follow a trail of stars to victory. It's, 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 um, symbolic or whatever. I, I don't know. That's the G! You can't see it very well, but trust me, it exists. All right, we got to go back into the urchin maze, but this time they're moving ever so slightly up and down. What a fun time this is. My fish turned into bananas, and such is the circle of life. Uh, it's a beautiful thing, that. Uh, all right, coin is in here somewhere, but 
Who even knows where that guy is? Man, coin, you were very difficult to get today. I don't know if I'll be able to solve this uh, conundrum of a puzzle you got going on here, but I think maybe I'll manage somehow, some way. Pothole panic. If I'm remembering right, this level's weird. Um, okay, first off, this is like a level devoted to animal buddies that you don't turn into but instead ride, but also a level devoted to, like, the, the, the birds that have stuff in them, but also these guys that throw bombs. Like, this level doesn't know what it wants to be, I think, is the issue. I'm not, I'm not really sure what the theme is supposed to be. Also, you can't, like, kill these guys, and you can't really interact with them at all. Also, copters are back. They are immune to, uh, anything Squawks chucks up at them. Which is really unfortunate, but, I mean, y you can't always kill stuff with, you know, cookies or eggs or whatever. It's just, it's an unfortunate fact of life. Whoops. Well, there goes Kitty. Down into the depths of off-screen he goes. I mean, there's a single banana inside that bird. Wowzers! These guys are technically enemies, so you gotta, you gotta watch out, man. They're ever so slightly in the way. Also, there is water involved, and now a fish. See you later, Squawks. He just kind of flew away. He was, he was done with this. He doesn't want any part of this shenanigans. Oh man, I killed an urchin. I am the best. Also, when I said it was devoted to the birds with stuff in them, I forgot. There are also fish with stuff in them, too. Heck yeah. I love stabbing those guys with the fish's nose. It is a thing that I enjoy doing. They all seem to have one single banana. It's not as exciting as it once was before, because now, I mean, it's predictable. There, there was no reason to disembark there, so I'm not really sure why I did it. Uh-oh. Problems. Problems exist in the world sometimes. You should be careful so as to not be, um, hurt by said, uh, problems. I'm pretty sure I should have gotten hit there, but I'm glad that I did not. Let's just say that. Is there anything up here b beyond the bananas? This is like a big ol' open area. That uh, has a fish. Hey, look! An elephant! Elephants are cool. I want to say there is something in this vicinity. Yeah, because you can kind of do the Yoshi jump thing that Mario World does where you just jump off of the elephant if you press the X button at the right time. Is there anything up there? Maybe is the answer to my question. Ah, all right, we can we can jump on copter. That's that's a potential way to go upward. Oh man, look how up I went. Well, there goes Ellie. Bye, Ellie. You're afraid of copter and also mice? That's weird. Yeah, I want to go and look up there, but I mean, I'm afraid to get stuck and and lose my elephant. Cuz you you don't know if there's anything up there or if it's a ceiling. You, you, you don't really have any way of knowing. It's kind of a silly sort of deal. Actually, I believe... Ah, yes, there it is. I saw it for a moment. This is the part where you actually do need to jump off of your elephant to get to the bonus. And then you gotta do the same thing in the bonus. I probably shouldn't be Dixie for this, but at the same time, being Dixie does have an advantage. I was saying you shouldn't be Dixie because, like... I constantly hold the Y button, so it makes me hover downward when I want to fall faster. It's, it's an unfortunate situation that elephants have a hard time swimming because they are not aquatic animals. There's also a spider up here. Um, alright. Whoops, well, there goes the spider. Spider, please, return to me! Whoa, 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 whoa! Spider, settle down. I wanted to check out what might be over here, but sadly, I was greeted with lag. Lag is a thing that exists. I also think I might have missed a minor secret or something uh, in the downward scape. Uh, but it's fine. Um, I believe what I am looking for is up there. 
Up there is a place that I can go. What is up here? A bonus for me. Cool. Oh yeah, I remember this bonus. This is, this is, this is um, something. Gotta dodge the bombs as they rain down. But uh, all the bananas appear where the bombs are, so, uh, well, most of them. Not always, but hey, you know, it's, it's that risk and reward business going on here. Oh no! I got blown up after the fact when it didn't matter anymore. Unfortunate. Um, can I put a spider web there and make it be useful? Probably, actually. Well, I mean, not anymore, but uh, that, that would have been a thing had I done. Ah, uh, here we go. Up here is where we will find secrets. I don't think that worked. <laughs> Did that work? What about this one? I feel like um, he's off screen enough that he doesn't actually exist. Um, ha! Take that, guy! I did a thing! Alright, well, um, that, that's, that's that level! <laughs> this level's weird, like, I'm not sure what it's trying to do. <laughs> it's, it just kind of exists, you know, it's, I don't know. Let's go say hi to Swanky! <laughs> hi, Swanky! How you doing? I'll play your video game. It's good, let's head to head. You can press the B button while walking in to walk in slightly faster. Don't take candy from me! That's rude! Candy's also the name of uh, another Kong that exists, so I wouldn't recommend taking her either. That took seven seconds. <laughs> a bonus prize! That was physical injury! You, s you just threw a ball at a literal baby! Why would you freaking cranky- come on. Cranky. It's a video game, chill out. <laughs> Uh, uh, next time we're going onward to that K over there. Is that K with you? I hope so, because, I mean, it's pretty much my only option at this point. My only option. No other options. Anyway, see you later and goodbye.